look at the state's coronavirus vaccination strategy is underscoring the need for patients tonight. It could be fall before the general public can get a shot depending on the supply of vaccines. As the schedule stands right now, phase two may not begin until October or November. It's for people 16 to 64 years old and not covered in previous phases. The vaccine dashboard shows almost 59,000 more shots in arms since yesterday. 7 Action News reporter Jennifer Ann Wilson has more on the state's strategy and what local health officials are saying about it. Local health officials are thrilled to see the state has put together such a robust strategy, but some elements just don't seem to make much sense to apply based on the number of vaccine doses they're receiving right now. There's nothing wrong in, in you know, dreaming big. Wayne County's top doc gives us a dose of reality after seeing the state's ambitious 17 page vaccination strategy. These are very good theoretical steps. The state's strategy includes getting more people vaccinated, which entails building a robust network of vaccination sites and utilizing the National Guard. We don't want anyone, whether you're in an urban area or a rural area, to have to go more than 20 minutes to get to a vaccination site, and that's really, really important. But that's a hard pill to swallow for Wayne County, which, like several others, received fewer vaccines this week than last. It is great to say we want to have people not drive more than 20 minutes to get vaccinated. But again, are you letting five people only not drive 20 minutes to get vaccinated when you have 100 doses that you need to do now? So, uh, divide them into all those remote places. While not everything in the strategy makes sense logistically right now, Detroit's public health officer is thrilled to see a focus on education and accessibility. I feel like it's an equitable approach to ensuring that everyone who wants to get vaccinated can get access to this life-saving tool. But when will they get access? This timeline from the state indicates school employees won't all receive their first vaccination doses until late summer. For the general public, it'll be October-ish, and it could be 2022 before the state's goal of 70% of the population receives their first vaccine dose. That's more than a year after the vaccination efforts first began. State health officials are still hopeful that the vaccine supply will increase and they'll be able to administer those vaccines even sooner. I'm Jennifer Ann Wilson, 7 Action News. All right, thank you so much, Jennifer Ann.